When I'm making these videos, I often add data to QGIS. And to do that, I would usually click the data source manager button, go to vector, and then I would browse to where I've got my data stored. I'll do that now quickly. And I have this in my D drive in a folder called YouTube in a subfolder called files. And then I would usually find the file I'm looking for and add it to QGIS. But if I'm doing this over and over again, it kind of makes sense to set up this folder as a favorite location. And I can do that using the browser in QGIS. The browser on my screen is in the lower left. If you don't see the browser, you can go to view, panels and turn it on. Now here, what I can do is I can navigate through my different folders. So I've got my D folder here and I'll just navigate to D, YouTube, and then I'll expand this and I'm looking for files. So let's find that. There we go, files. And that's what I've got the files that I usually use here. So I'll right click that folder and add as favorite. And now what happens is, if I go to my favorite section in the browser, you can see I've set one up already as a favorite, but now this location with my files for these YouTube videos is a favorite. And then I can just expand this and instead of having to click lots of times to get to the folder, I can just look through, I can see a file in this case, uh, let's take this one called Berlin areas. I can see the fields in the folder in the, um, in the shape file, or I can just left click and drag and drop that into the map. So that's how you can quickly set up an individual folder on your computer as a favorite location. And this is really useful if you're working with a particular folder again and again, and you can set up as many favorites as you like. You just navigate to where it is. And once you're done, you can right click and choose add as favorite. Hopefully that'll save you a few clicks in your own work.